Sunday, May 26, 2024 Most Holy Trinity Focus Go therefore and make disciples, baptizing them in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. In today's first reading, the Lord demands recognition from His chosen people. He refreshes their minds about all the wonders and care He has showered upon them. Fast forward to the last moments of Jesus among his disciples. In his final command before ascending to heaven, he refreshes their minds, reminding them of their mission. Days later, the Holy Spirit will reinforce Jesus' command and the world will never be the same again. Go, the Mass is ended. These are the last words the celebrant says at the conclusion of the Eucharist. The imperative, go, carries a deep significance. It reminds us that the mission of Christ is now in our hands. Are we ready to take up the challenge, despite the odds we face? Today is the Feast of the Most Holy Trinity, three persons in unity. We will never understand this mystery, even as St. Augustine tried and failed. But we are fortunate that Jesus spoke at length on this sacred matter. He clarified the unique task of each of the three persons has. God the Father and the Holy Spirit played an important role in the life of Jesus. Jesus explained this to his disciples and to us. Fruit In my own life I must go and carry out Jesus' command to spread the word and make disciples.